so i hope all of you enjoyed the part one wherein i explained the indications of the cih as well as the dsi implant so those of you have missed it please refer to part one wherein the airline series has two wonderful conventional implants and with the same kit same drivers you can place the cih and the dsi implants and i have explained the design of both the implants and the indication in part one so in case you have missed it please watch it but let us focus in part two the surgical kit along with a live demo of how exactly to use this kit in the patient so just come closer let me show you this wonderful surgical kit of the cih so this is the cih implant and this is the dsi implant so this is the kit which will be useful for you to place both this implants in either immediate or delayed loading protocol and if you wish to do prosthetic digitally or manually it's everything is possible so let us focus on this wonderful kit so as you see this autoclavable surgical kit it has the drills 2.0 2.5 2.8 and 3.2 3.65 4.2 and 5.2 if you see in terms of the entire drill it will have this wonderful laser markings which are corresponding to the length of the implant so the laser markings are there which are corresponding to the length of the implants so this is regarding the drills and i will show you how to use them this is the marking drill over here this is the marking drill parallel pin hex drivers long and short so these are the long and short hex drivers and these are the fixture drivers which are useful for placement of the implant now this fixture drivers can be used for both your cih implant as well as your dsi implant so both the internal platforms are connected and interchangeable so you can use it depending on your situation in the mouth you can use it a CIH as well as a DSI for those who want to place the implant with the motor so this is the motor micro motor so those of you who want to place the implant with the motor we are having the motor design also this is the 1.25 hex driver this is the hex driver on the motor and this is the fixture driver in the motor okay so both these are available in the motor designs also the hex driver as well as the fixture driver so let me show you okay so this is compatible with the cih as well as the dsi so depending upon how you wish to place the implant either with the motor or with the hand grip you can place it okay so this is regarding the motor one more amazing thing with this kit which i think is not available with many kits apart from this amazing driver ratchet is this locking mechanism of implant so a lot of time when we place the implants you know these implants tend to fall off from the driver but as you see here the kit has a locking driver which means that i can place this driver and lock it and now if you see once i have locked it this implant is never going to fail even if there is any movement happening so this is unless you open up the lock this implant is not going to loosen up and you can see this amazing lock over here it is usable for again for both the implants cih as well as your dsi implant this amazing unique feature the other thing you can also do is use it as a spare hex driver just in case you have lost your hex driver you can use your ratchet over the hex driver also even with the lock in place you can ratchet it so these are some amazing features available with the airline series of implants which probably are not available anywhere else so you can see this how nicely everything is combining along with this locking mechanism over here so this is a amazing locking driver which probably i have not seen in any other company so i hope this introductory video about the surgical kit for the crh and the dsi implant was helpful to you do join me in my next session where i'm going to demonstrate to you on the patient models how exactly to use both these implants thank you